Oh, the top names in tennis are in town. This is a live look at Mason and the calm before all of the center court action. It's quiet there tonight, but soon it won't be that way. We are just one day away now from the Western and Southern Tennis Tournament. Today was all about putting the finishing touches on and off the court. WLWT News Live's Christy Davis serves up a behind the scenes look. The closer it gets to tournament play, the closer fans get to players as they warm up for the main event. Their only concern, perfecting their game. We take great pride in making sure that it's a comfortable environment for the players and they're great volunteers, very gracious volunteers who take care of them and help them with anything from uh, hotel reservations, restaurant reservations, tea times, whatever they may need. That includes specific shopping requests and even trips to Kings Island. And the tournament has to protect their privacy, but players still make sure they connect with the public. Yeah, and the players are really fan friendly. I mean, there's so many great touch points with the players from the um, practice courts to the player entrance. And while the players take care of business on court, off court, it's all about getting those finishing touches in place for all the fans. We've been out here since last Monday um, doing a lot of fixtures. Just a few hours before the doors open on the largest pop up tennis retailer in the Midwest, where fans who can't play like the pros can at least dress like them. Yeah, you can buy all the player gear here uh, Roger Federer's gear, uh, Andy Murray's gear, Maria Sharapova, and Serena Williams. Outside, the entire grounds have blossomed overnight. Tents for the 14 restaurants are up and ready. The bars, wine garden, and jumbo screen will be done in time for the 190,000 tennis fans to pass through over the next two weeks. These businesses will see uh, a lot of foot traffic uh, that maybe they wouldn't have seen otherwise. Making it an experience to remember for everyone involved. At the Lindner Family Tennis Center, Christy Davis, WLWT News 5. Now, tomorrow, you and the kids can get the chance to see some of your favorites at Grader's Kids Day. The players are going to be out there to meet all the little kiddos and maybe even sign a few autographs, too.